is because it's not a force win. Like, even though technically it might be winning, it's going to take like another 20 moves to win. That's just force mate in five. Oh my gosh. I got scared there because they didn't play a move. I got really scared there for a second because I'm, I'm expecting another move if it's correct. So let's do it move by move. So 95, Rook takes E5, Rook F8, King G7, check King G8, eight. I got some spaghetti just, just sort of tied me over. Pin to win. There, there's a class pin to win. You're toast if you don't, if you don't win on the spot. Number 60, 60 Uno. Um, what are the moves? There's, uh, there's, there's H2, there's Bishop E4, there's Rook E5 as well. Um, no, I said 1499.99. I think, um, it's, it's pretty obvious what that means. Thank you, Velocity Kill for the Prime. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Um, okay, what do we have here? We have Bishop E4, we have H2, um, my instinct is that it might wait no rookie five takes bishop e4 queen f4 takes takes doesn't work so it has to be bishop e4 to start and then white goes queen e2 and then i have to figure out what the move is is it h2 um i think it is this feels too easy which is actually a bad sign this feels way too easy i think it's just bishop d4 queen queen d1 or queen e2 and then h2 takes rookie five Maybe not. Maybe I'm maybe I'm maybe I'm being silly. Maybe I'm not thinking straight. Okay, what I do know is it's not rookie five. Um they get a showdown for the 10, so it's either it's either Bishop E4 or it's H2. Nothing else works here. Uh but what is the difference? I guess is the question. If I play H2 takes Bishop E4, he again has Queen E1, Queen D2. What is the difference? What is the difference? What is the difference? What is the difference? I'm, I'm struggling to figure this out. Um, I mean, Bishop E4 has to be right. I, I don't. H2 looks wrong because H2 takes Bishop E4. Nothing. Um, I don't. I don't know. I think it's. Okay, Bishop E4, Queen D1, H2 takes. Rook takes e5, f3, queen... Okay, so bishop e4, queen d1. h2 takes. Rook e5. Um, White can also go g4 there, I just wrote. Oh, then rook h5, then king g3. 5, king g3. No, that can't be right. But then that means the whole concept can't be right. Because if I play bishop e4, queen d1, h2 takes rook e5, g4, check, king g3, and that's not right. Oh, but then I have rook h1, takes... I think I think it has to be bishop e4, though. Because h2 doesn't... I Because I don't see any differential, so I guess it's bishop e4. Okay, that's good. Okay, step one is in the book. Okay. So now what are the moves? Rook e5, f3, h2, king h1, and you resign. The rook e5's bad. I, well, rook e5, f3, rook f5 takes, takes queen d5. No, but that's not right. Okay, so not rook e5. H2 or what else? H2 looks like the only move here. Maybe a rook f8 also, but I guess rook f8, there's just bishop e3. Wait a second, wait a second. We are deep in puzzles, so it could be something nuanced like Rook F8 now that I think about it. But let, let, let me work this out. Okay, so wait. So H2, King H2. Rook E5. How does White stop me? Because F3, there's Queen H5, King G2, Bishop F3, which is good. Not easy. Okay, so wait. So H2, King... Although actually, okay, so rookie five f three resigns. So h two king h two rookie five. E five um. But there is king g one rook h five f three, and you have nothing good. Is it really something simple like rook f eight.
Rook F8, Queen D2, H2. So White can't guard after Rook F8. White can't guard on either of these squares because you're you're, threat, you're threatening to take and you play H2. Wait. So if you go Rook F8, King H2, you just take Queen D2, C1 are bad. Let's say White goes Bishop D2 or C1, you can just push and win. So Rook F8, Bishop E3 is the only move. So Rook F8, Bishop E3. Ah, but then maybe you just go H2. It's got... And then we're so deep in the puzzle at 61 that it could just be Rook F8. I doubt... I... But Rook E5 is too... It's not Rook E5. It's got to be Rook F8. Oh, it goes... Oh, wait. King H2 is just simple. Because now it takes, takes, and mate. Okay. There we go. All right. Uh, okay, what are the moves? There's knight d3 here. There's bishop g5. Not many more moves. Um, four more. Oh, yeah, we got to get four more. Yeah. All oh, right. We also have a uh, title Tuesday. Let me let me sign up for title Tuesday just very briefly, you guys. Just so just so that we can get back to puzzles and not um not forget. Yeah, we 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 tilted Tuesday. Um. Okay, I don't know why it's not just Bishop G5. That looks that looks very obviously good, but it could be very obviously wrong. Okay, what are the moves? There's knight d3, bishop g5, and knight d3 are both moves, right? So so both these are moves. Um what else is there? should be some sort of tactic in here oh i think i just got it i think it's take six knight h3 of a king e2 and i thought it was rook g5 well i guess white can just go queen h2 so maybe it's not hmm not so obvious knight d3 king e2 again you're behind a material here so you have to have something fast um you have to have something pretty fast here in this position because since you're down I guess you're you're down what you've got one two three so you're down an entire rook here so you better have something really really fast or else you're gonna end up in a lot of trouble basically so let's see um yeah I'm trying to figure this out what are the what are the options here we go for checkmate yeah um hmm Oh, this is a very annoying puzzle. I mean, you can take... Check. Queen h2, queen f3. King d2, rook g2. I mean, you're better, but maybe not winning. Knight d3 is a move. I have no idea. Knight h3, queen h2, check. King d2. I mean, you have queen g5 at the end, which is also good. I think I'm going to trust my instinct. I think it's... I, th I think I'm going to trust my instinct and probably get this one wrong. I'm going to trust my instinct. And I think it's wrong, but I, 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 I'm on a good run. It's not knight takes d3, I don't think. I don't think it's knight takes d3. I think my I think my idea is right though. I actually do. I think my idea is right. I, I do think my idea is right though. I mean, what else could it be? Yeah, I think my idea is right. I'm gonna trust I'm gonna trust my idea. It's not an ATX D2, it's too too routine. Okay, good. Okay, now the question is which move is this? Is it knight h3 or knight d3? I think it's knight h3 because if I take on d3 after king e3, rook g5, white just trades and takes the pony on d3. So I think it's knight h3. Well, let me think for a second. Knight d3, king e3, like knight d3, king e3, knight e5 takes knight e1, rook e1, rook g5, queen f2. White's fine. So it's not knight d3. I think it's got to be knight h3. It just has to be knight knight h3. There's nothing else that makes sense. It has to be. It has to be knight h3, knight h3, and rook g5. It has to be knight h3. 
Because knight d3, king e3, rook g5, white just takes him. Queen f3, king d2, white wins. And if you take white, takes the, takes the knight on d3. Yeah. I think it's knight h3. Uh, knight d3 is... I just don't think it is. I think it's knight h3. I'm going to trust my I'm gonna trust my instinct. And maybe, maybe, maybe I'm wrong and chat will look like a genius. But I think it's knight h3. Chat, you, you guys are always wrong. I'm sorry. You're just always wrong. What can I say? Yep, exactly. Now I just take take and i actually had this puzzle right away this was my initial instinct and i had it right away thank you to rt hosty for the four months thank you so much um okay what is this this is black's playing one this should actually not be too difficult this should not be too difficult sorry guys oh man that smells good um let's see okay i can go c3 here um i can also play a2 What's cooking? Oh, I can smell bacon from like the kitchen again. I, I I can yeah I can I can smell it. It's like I can that's like it's it's wafting over here again. It's annoyingly it smells annoyingly good. <laughs> and it's probably only gonna get worse. Um. Okay. Oh, all right. Let's see. What are the moves here? So a two is an obvious move. A two king e four. Um. Maybe it's knight one bishop a1, c3, but then king d3, king gets around. Okay. What are the moves here? Uh, what are the moves? The only moves that make sense here are a2, c3, knight g4, knight c2. Actually, knight c2, king c4 is just a draw. So knight c2 is definitely wrong. So it's either knight g4, a2, or c3. It's one of these three moves. They're all... Okay, so let's start with c3. c3 takes takes f7 to draw so it's not c3 and it's not knight c2 these two moves don't work then it really is a2 or it's knight g4 those are the only two moves that make any sense um i think it's actually knight g4 here so i'm, I'm gonna look at a2 first i think knight g4 is actually winning so i'm gonna look at a2 uh because that seems like the that seems like the the more um the line with this the more clear-cut idea so a2 if white takes you take f7 a1 f8 go check king f3 queen f1 and you collect the queen so a2 king e3 is bad so a2 king e4 is the only move then after knight c2 bishop b2 how do you win i don't think you win that's the problem i think i don't think you win i don't think you i don't think you're winning after that my instinct is that it's knight g4 knight g4 looks very very surprisingly simple because after king c4 takes king b3 knight c4 you just win and after knight g4 the bishop goes away you just go a2 and if knight g4 f7 you just take bishop h8 you go a2 takes knight f6 i mean may maybe maybe i'm looking maybe I maybe i'm stupid but it this looks very obvious oh uh, yeah it, 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 it is obvious it's just simple you just take take and you go knight c4 yep there we go 63 you a new guam for the prime this one also looks too easy by the way this looks like takes and takes okay i need to slow slow my horses down because now i'm starting to get too too uh, cocky um actually wait no i'm not. no this is just easy you just take 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 check check queen e7 collect the okay let's be cocky it's just takes 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 and check and you just win the game am i stupid I have to slow my horse. I still have to slow my horses down. This is the title for a YouTube video. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, all right. Yeah. I, I just, I kind of had to trust myself. Wait, now this one looks too. E Wait. Okay. This one looks too. Am I getting too cocky? Isn't this one too super obvious? Check here. Check here. Check here. Check here. Check mate. Isn't that just force mate in five? That's just force mate in five. When in doubt, be cocky. That's the bottom line. Let's go check and mate. Okay, there we go. Up to 65. There we go. Okay, what are the moves here? Um, Now you have F3. You have Knight F3. You also have something like Bishop B5 here. Yeah, I don't know how that was the 65th puzzle. Um, I, I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know. That shouldn't, that shouldn't have been. But hey, the doubters, I doubted again and, and lost again. Good one, three stinky fingers. Um, Congrats. 
my actual record is 117. Um, yeah, that that one was just. I mean, I got a little bit lucky with those those with those ones because they were they were too uh, too straightforward, way too straightforward. Um, all right, so what are the moves here? Let's see. There's knight f3. There's bishop b5. Um, there's rook d4 as well. Actually, my mouse was a little on battery. Give me one second, guys. How many more do, they, do I think we can squeeze in before Title Tuesday? Hopefully about another like five or six. That's the goal. Um, my record is 117, but I, I think 65 is very near. I think when I got to 117, I think I got to like 68. 68 was zero wrong. That's what I think it was. Again, sorry, I got to charge my mouse because we definitely don't want to be uh, ha have to be corded in when um, when we're playing Title Tuesday. No, it just it, it runs. It, the battery runs low. Title Tuesday is in uh, 30 minutes. Exactly, you guys. Um, uh oh, oh actually I'm I'm blind. I thought this was a queen on d8. I thought my king was on f6 and my queen was on d8. I I looked at the position wrong. Okay, so this one actually um I thought this looked too easy after takes. But takes takes you don't have a clear cut win. Uh what are the options? Um let's see. Knight f3 is also a, probably a good move with take. No, knight f3 is wrong. Okay, knight f3 is bad. Knight f3 is bad. Let's let's do it piece by piece. Knight f3 is bad because of takes. Knight g4 is bad because of rook d7. Takes, takes, and then you then this pyramid of Giza. Um, so you can't play knight g4, you can't play knight f3. So you can't move the knight. Okay, so it's not a knight move. It's not a rook move. It's not any of these pawn moves. Not that it's not any, it's really just none of these moves. So that means that it has to be either a pawn move, a queen move, or a bishop move. Let's start with the bishop move. So bishop g4 looks good. But after bishop g4, I think queen e4 and queen a8 is bad. Does not look right. No, bishop g4 cannot be right. So it's not a bishop move, which means it's either a um it's either a pawn move. That's yeah, a pawn move. I think it's just a pawn move. It's a pawn move, or I mean, I mean, I guess it could be bishop b5. That is, that is a fair point that it could be bishop b5. Queen e4, rook f1, king g2. But it still goes on. Thank you to JDH for the 1,000 bits. Thank you, Sebastian, for the four months. Appreciate it. Um, what are the options? Could be, it could be Knight F3, actually. It could be Knight F3, Knight F3, EF, FE3, but I don't think so. I have no idea. Hmm. Oh, this is very difficult. Um, I really have no idea. I have no idea. I ha I have really. I just have no idea. There are many moves that make sense here, but all, all, all of them look questionable. Yeah. I feel an aha coming. Maybe. This is very difficult. This puzzle, I don't really have any strong read on. I mean, my instinct says like F3 or Knight F3, but I don't have any really strong read. F3 also doesn't look... I mean, F3 looks okay, but it doesn't look right somehow. Maybe it is right, actually. Maybe, maybe it is just right. Queen H5... Queen H5 and then what though? I don't see a move. I just don't see it. I really don't know because I mean all the moves look playable here. F, F I mean F takes E3 and F3 look playable. Um I think it's I think it's a pawn move though. I think it's a 50-50. I think it's either F3 or F E3. I just don't know which one it is. That's all. I mean my, my instinct says that it's F takes E3. That's just my my gut instinct is that it's F takes E3. But I, I, I don't know. Like, that's my gut instinct is that it's F takes E3. But I mean, 
it's like there, there are many things so like i know that f takes e3 f takes e3 bishop b5 is winning for sure like that there's there's no doubt that that's winning like for sure that, that that's winning but the problem is f takes e3 rook takes d7 takes f takes e3 is also not completely clear cut either that's the problem um there's also bishop b5 which is but bishop b5 queen e4 takes king g2 yeah i i don't know i really don't know i i mean i don't know i don't know my instinct is that it's it's probably f3 or bishop b5 the more i think about it i think it's f3 or bishop b5 i just don't know which one it is i don't think it's bishop b5 i i, I don't know i i mean it's every move that I look at looks better than f3 but I, I actually the more I think about it, the more I think it is f3 I think it's just f3 and I then maybe it should be five or maybe it's f3 and then take your time I bet 34k yeah I am taking my time but go a5 yes it's a5 a5 yeah I don't have a way to really calculate this to the end because it's not it's not straightforward it's move by move um so I think I'm gonna trust my instinct here because every move that I, I I've tried to f make everything work and nothing else works. And I think the more that I look at this, the more I think I think it's just I think it is F3. I think it's F3 and Bishop B5. I, I really do think so. Um it's F3 or F takes E3. I just don't know which one. That's that's the problem. Hmm. Ask yourself what would Badur do? Um It's very hard. I think it's a 50-50. I think I'm gonna trust my instinct that it's F3. I think I'm gonna trust my instinct. Um I don't know. I really don't know. This is really difficult. is really difficult I mean it could be F takes I mean ha I don't know what it is now you know what I'm gonna go the other way I'm gonna go with the other line I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go with this in Bishop b5 I just realized on fe3 if rook d7 king d7 takes I can even go rook d4 ed4 knight f3 King h1, queen h6 wins, king f2, queen d4 wins. So no, I'm going to go the other way. I'm going to play f takes e3. I'm going to go the other way because now that I know that rook d7 doesn't work, white has to take on e3, and then bishop b5 must be winning for black. Okay. Let, let's, let, let, let's, 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 please, please be right. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, okay. It's right. Okay. So, I mean, you don't want to move the knight back. You take. Yeah, now just rook d4, knight f3. Or that's just what my last calculation was. So, it, it, I mean... I, I, this is what I said. So live by the sword, die by the sword. I think. I think live by the sword, die by the sword with rook, rook d4, knight f3. Checking. Maybe not, though. Wait. If I take, take knight f3, king f2. Okay, wait a second. So I check king g3. I check king f2. I check king g3, but then... Ah, oh, but then I don't have a mate. What? What? But it has to be rook d4. I mean, okay, it has to be, no? Oh, it just goes... Oh, it didn't go to f2. Okay, so yeah, now I just... Now I just mop it up. <sighs> very difficult. Very, very difficult. Um... Okay, now here you're you're up material. What do you have? You have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You're up at rook and four pawns, but white has a knife on f5. Now the good thing is this one should be easy. 
because this one i think it's this one is should be a straightforward calculation with rookie eight if 97 king h8 you win so rookie eight 97 is no good if rookie eight um if rookie eight queen g5 you just take and go king h7 and you win the so rookie eight knight h6 is the only move king g7 loses king h7 loses king h8 takes takes rook h1 king g8 queen g5 rook g7 and you win i believe check there there check on e6 block check on g6 king f8 you have to be winning yeah this has to be winning with rook a8 and nothing else makes sense there's no other moves that can hold so it has to be here okay now we know for example g7 loses to queen g5 so you can't go here you go here he checks and you lose the game uh i think you lose the game it has to be h8 okay you have to capture hey there we go good thank you to riggy for the three thank you mr swes for the 15 thank you to coaxial for the prime appreciate it. what am i looking at i'm staring at this guy trying to calculate a line in my head okay 67 three more to go it's very very difficult um very very difficult oh was there a bet on 67 maybe there was a bet or no there wasn't okay it's on 69 all right yeah if i get to 69 man the doubters are gonna be pissed off pissed off hard um okay what can i do this one actually looks very unpleasantly difficult um the only moves that make sense are queen d8 or rook f7 those are the only two moves that that i see that make make any sense here um okay but queen d8 rook f8 wait a second wait a second so if i check rook f8 takes takes bishop to c3 check is just gg actually because king g8 i go queen g7 queen e7 king g6 i take wait 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 so check bishop f8 is the only move but then i just trade the juicers and i go bishop c3 anyway and i'm winning wait this seems too easy wait I need to slow down this seems a little bit too easy okay this seems a little bit too easy wait I I, I need to slow down a second um let's think queen d8 queen d8 bishop f8 trade trade bishop c3 No, that, that 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 seems too simple. Hmm. 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 Okay, rook f7, king f7 cannot be right. So it can't be rook f7. I mean, if it's not queen d8, I don't really know what else it can be because I'm very confident. I, although maybe it could be takes and and g4. No, but then d2. Probably still good, but no, that can't be right. think it's not takes in g4 it's got to be queen d8 bishop f8 and then where's the win there is no win no there's no win because bishop c3 bishop e7 huh yeah i'm, I'm really confused here This is very, very difficult. I, I really have no idea what this puzzle is. Um, hmm. I have no idea what this is. Yeah, queen d8 is the move I want to play, but after queen d8, bishop f8, I'm struggling to find a, a winning line. In fact, I don't think it exists. <sighs> Although, wait, actually, I just realized there is a trick. In, there is a trick in here. Wait, so if I go check, so if I check, actually, wait, I gotta be careful. I don't accidentally mouse slip. So if I check block, take, take, and play bishop c3, Bishop e7, queen h8, queen e2, I have d6. And if bishop e4, I win. If takes, I win. 
Oh, maybe that's maybe that actually I think that's what it is now. So check here. Kx takes bishop c3, bishop e7, queen h8. If d2 though, d6 maybe. D6. I think that wins. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's queen d8. It's got to be queen d8. As no, it's not pawn to g4, but thank you for that idiotic suggestion. Much, much appreciated. Um, it's It's got to be queen d8. It, there's nothing else that makes sense. Yeah, it's g4. Nice, nice move. That's, that's, that's a ridiculous move, but thank you for the suggestion. Yeah, g, g4, rook c7, queen c7, bishop b4, and you promptly resign. But thank you. Anyway, um, put it all in caps. Like, I mean, please. Okay. So I'm pretty, I'm pretty confident it's queen d8. Um, I think it's queen d8. It's got to be queen d8. It's got to be queen d8. It cannot be anything but queen d8. Why it's so toxic? Uh, you should say that to the guy who wrote that because he spammed it in all, all caps a couple of times. He didn't just write it normally. He wrote it in all caps like three times. Um, I think it's queen d8 though. I, I, I have to believe, I have to believe that I'm right. I, I have to believe that it's queen d8. It is good. It's right. Okay. So if d6, there's bishop e4. Um, I think it's takes and. I mean, it can't be d6. There's just bishop e4. It has to be takes. There's no other move. Black's running bishop e4 to end the game in one go. So you go d6, bishop e4, you resign. You go bishop b4, bishop e4, you resign. So you can't move these. It's not a queen move. I mean, it's not a pawn. I mean, pawns, same thing. So it's not a pawn move. No, it's not I mean it's not I mean it can only be a rook move it can only be one rook move and it can only be a rook move and there there are no rook moves that make sense except rook f7 so by the process of elimination again it has to be takes good now the good thing is now this position has simplified quite a bit so I think I think my exact line with bishop c3 and queen h8 is in fact right um okay yeah this has to be right Okay, and it's d6 is exactly the line that I just mentioned. And I, I think it's winning after d6. Bishop has no squares. And I, it has to be d6. It has to be d6. It has to be d6. Queen h7. <laughs> uh okay thank you um all right <laughs> okay um okay give me a second sorry all right um <laughs> all right okay um sorry about that okay okay let's see um yeah okay i'm pretty sure it's d6 because no other moves make sense um what else could it be if it's not d6 so i'm trying to find a candidate move um there are no other moves that make sense d6 bishop e4 queen g7 wins bishop f8 queen f6 wins um only question is does he have like d6 bishop h3 but again i think i can ah uh, checking e8 and I don't have a actually wait d6 allows d6 allows bishop h3 wait a second this is still very complicated wait so so d6 bishop h3 I go queen g7 king e8 takes 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 a3 I'm in time oh man this is very difficult oh I really don't know. I mean, I don't see any other moves that make sense. Let me think about this. What other moves make sense? Okay. It's not a pawn. It's not uh, one of these three. It's not a king move or a bishop move. So, I mean, it has to be a queen or a bishop. I mean, queen, bishop, or pawn. It's not a bishop move, obviously, because there's no point. So, it's either d6 or a queen move. So, it's really this or this. Let's start with this. Queen g7, king e8. Queen g8, king d7. You have no way to win.
okay queen g7 can't work i think again i have to go by the, by the process of elimination it has to be d6 i just have to find the the line against bishop h3 that's winning because i don't see it yet um i don't see it yet i don't actually see it d6 looks right though d6 looks like the right move but i just i don't I don't see the win after d6 bishop h3 that's the problem i really don't see the win um i really have no idea d6 looks like the right move that that's what i will see i will say um I don't see anything else that makes sense. Queen h6, d2 loses. I have no idea. I mean, I, I still think it's... Oof. I, I think it's d6, but after bishop h3. Uh, why am I not considering queen g7? Uh, uh, because queen g7, king e8, I don't see a move. Yeah, I think I think it's got to be D six. Ooh, um, I think I'm gonna trust my instinct. I I, I think it's D. I maybe it's wrong, but if it's not if it's not D six, well the thing is if D six Bishop H three King H three is Queen H five mate. But I'm gonna I'm gonna trust. Yeah, but you can't go g4 because after bishop d6 you lose the game you guys so <sighs> i think i'm gonna trust my instinct i i don't know i'm gonna trust my instinct i think it is d6 i i don't see it right off but i think my instinct is that after d6 takes chuck king here takes 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 after g4 with the pawn of the white square i can probably win a bishop and pawn end game so i'm gonna go for it and just just pray that I'm right oh <gasps> oh it's good okay oh my gosh I got scared there because they didn't play a move I got really scared there for a second because I'm, I'm expecting another move if it's correct okay um okay okay now this one I've seen but I don't remember the line right off um I've seen this puzzle before for sure but I don't remember the exact move order yeah um scared by chess yeah yeah very scared um no because I because the thing is normally you hear the sound you hear is different that's not the sound you hear I, every every time that I've closed closed my eyes during the speed or not speed run during this uh, series of tactics like it's normally a straightforward solution actually I think it's check queen up to a knight of three I think that's what it wait no but then there's d4 wait Ah, it's Bishop G3. Is it Bishop G3, Knight F3? I think it's Bishop G3, Knight F3. That's why, because if Bishop H4, King G2, Queen F2, King H3, Knight F3, White can play D4 and you don't have any, any check mating ideas, but when you go here, here, check here, here, now Knight G1 and Queen H2 wins with the Bishop on G3 targeting. It targets this one versus on H4 where it doesn't target this pawn. So it's got to be here. Let me just double check. Knight F3 knight f3 knight f3 and then white has no way out white has no way out knight f3 knight f3 knight f3 yeah there's no way out check king d8 wins king three yeah yeah there's no way out it's got to be here there we go 69 you guys 69 up 69 up 69 down I think you had this one before yeah no that's very good okay so now what is what are the moves here let's see if we can get one more wait isn't this just checkmate wait this is did i just get another easy puzzle this is perfect i check and if the king goes to f6 is mate and if the king goes to d6 i check king d5 knight c oh he's queen c oh 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 wait i gotta not be too cocky here i was about to get really cocky and go queen three here i was thinking check but then 
wait, wait, wait. So check king d6, check king d5. I want to play knight c3, but he takes six and has rook e8. And it's not so simple. Um, this should not be that difficult. Though. This feels like a puzzle that I should... There should be a simple solution to it. Um, the thing is, you're down on material, so you have to come up with something fast. Fast, fast, fast. Um, oh, I think I got it. I think it's here, here, check, here, check. And at back, you take king c5, b4, king b5, knight c3, and you win the game. Yes. Yes, it has to be check, I think. Now, I think it's check here and it's check. Very important. Um, title Tuesday is what, in five minutes? Okay. Um, I check on g5, e4, queen e3, king d5 is no good. If king d4, queen e3 is winning. It's got to be check. It's got to be check on, on e7. I'm pretty sure it's queen e7. King d5, queen g5. Yeah, it's got to be check. And now it's got to be check here. Not not knight c3, because after take takes rook e8, it's unclear. But you go check. King d4, queen e3, knight, king d5, knight c3, takes, takes, wins. King e4, check, knight c3, wins. So check, rook f5, takes. Oh, no, sorry. Rook f5, you can also just take the rook. So that's bad. So check here, check. Yeah. It's got to be queen g5. Check, and there we go. We get to 70, you guys.